scared there again. True. Hello, this is Business Live from the BBC with Sally Bandock and Ben Thompson. Italy on a collision course with Brussels over its planned spending spree, but Rome says it won't back down on costly election promises. We're live, we're in London, and that is our top story today, Monday the 15th of October. Italy's populist government is about to submit its budget plans to the European Commission. But can it afford to boost spending on infrastructure and welfare whilst at the same time lowering the retirement age? Also on the programme, it is a big week for Brexit. Chief negotiators are still struggling to reach agreement on the Irish border, which remains a key sticking point. And European markets look a bit like this. The DAX in Frankfurt is not open for technical problems. We'll explain all you need to know. Also around the world, publishers are struggling as they battle the digital revolution. We're going to talk to One UK magazine. It believes there's still a future in print. And as the iconic department store Sears files for bankruptcy in the US, we want to know, are we as consumers partly to blame for the crisis on our high streets? Just use the hashtag BBCBizLive. Hello to you, a very warm welcome to the programme. As always, there's a lot to fit in, but we're going to start today in Italy because the Italian government could be on the fast track to a spectacular showdown with the European Commission later. Why? Well, it's all because of its spending plans. Like the other 18 EU countries that 